Hey again, everyone. So, wanted to bring you guys a new recipe tonight. No, it's not Meatless Monday, but I wanted to show you the healthiest of meals, but it's not the worst either. So, I figured I'll share it. But, um, I don't even know what to call it because I've kind of like thought of it myself, but, um, it's like, I'll call it a cabbage meal. <laughs> okay? Quick little meal when I don't feel like cooking. And I want to make sure that every bell everybody's bellies are full. And this is one good way of doing it. So I hope you guys enjoy the recipe. And Okay, first you're going to dice up a half an onion. And then you're going to saute that in your saute pan um, with one tablespoon of olive oil on medium heat. After that is um, tender, then you're going to turn your heat down to medium low and you're going to add in your cut up cabbage um, green cabbage to the sauteed onions then you are going to add your seasonings seasonings that I added were one tablespoon of thyme one tablespoon of pepper and one tablespoon of this here not the healthiest thing for you, but um, yeah, like I stated, this is not a super healthy dish, but it's not a super bad one either. So sometimes it's okay to eat uh, what is considered not too, too healthy, but just not regularly. And, um, you know, just be careful. Okay, so while your cabbage is um, steaming and cooking in the pot, then you want to come and chop up your kielbasa um, sausage link things that you have. Um, this is the one that I use, so I chop it up like this. Um, this is the one that I use. Okay, so it's a uh, turkey kielbasa. Okay, again, not one of the best things for you, but like I stated before, this is not a super healthy recipe, but it's not the worst either. Okay, so you're going to chop that up, and then you're going to fry that in a skillet. I don't add any oil or anything to it. I just put it in there and fry it. So, okay, so we're going to let this continue to cook, the sausage to continue to cook down. I just added um, green onion into it and you're just going to saute that into it. And um, you don't want it to get like it's going to go into the cabbage and then it'll cook some more in there so you don't want it to get like super dried out you want to be able to keep it moist and um, juicy so now we'll just cook this on low like medium low and um, once the cabbage has softened up and cooked down then we'll add the meat to it okay so the cabbage has cooked down it's nice and tender you can see the onions are nice and sauteed in there. Good. Everything looks good. And now we're going to add in the sausage. The sausage has been added into there now, I see. And I just poured, even though it was like a little bit of juice from the sausage. And so I poured that in here as well. So now you just mix it all together. So, the last thing you're going to do is add in two tablespoons of minced garlic and then mix that in. I um, like my garlic to still stay kind of fresh, so I always mix it in last in my dishes so it doesn't cook down so much. You get more out of garlic when you eat it in its natural state. There you have it. My cabbage meal creation. I don't really know what to call it. It's something I've just created myself and tastes good. Um, so yeah, there you have it. A cabbage meal. <laughs> but thank you guys for watching and I hope that you try it. Be healthy. Ah.